today we're going to make a chocolate hazelnut pie with a homemade graham cracker crust and I hope you enjoy this. The ingredients are half a teaspoon of ground cinnamon, two tablespoons of granulated sugar, three quarter cup of melted butter, and one pack of graham crackers. We're going to put our graham crackers in a gallon zip zipper bag and beat them with a meat mallet till they're crushed up. The reason why I do it this way is because I have somebody in my family that has sensory issues and the food processor really bothers him. So we've learned to do things different with him. Now you take your uh, crackers, cup of crackers, and dump them in a bowl. And put our sugar in there. And our cinnamon. Stir that around a little bit. And then our butter. I'll just mix this by hand so I can get it well incorporated. Then I got a pie plate. I'm going to put it into the pipe light. And pack it in there. Spread it out. I'm going to help me with your hands. While my crust is baking, I'm going to make the filling. I've got half a cup of hazelnut spread, a half a block of cream cheese, four ounces of cream cheese, uh, three quarter cup of confectioner sugar, an eight ounce tub of uh, whipped topping, freezer whipped topping, and a half a cup okay, of to milk. To start with, we're going to put our cream cheese and our powdered sugar. We're going to mix that. We're going to put our beater on here. And you want to start this out on slow or you'll have a kitchen full of powdered sugar. And we don't want that. Okay, we've got that cream, real creamy. Now, next, we're going to add our hazelnut spread. My daughter really loves hazelnut spread. I mean, she eats it. She just loves it. And I'm kind of making this special for her since she likes it so well. And then we're going to put that and our milk in there. Again, we want to start out slow so we don't slosh milk everywhere. Uh, sounds like my pie crust is done. I heard the beeper, so I need to go and check that. I'm going to turn this off for a minute. Now I've got my pie crust out of the oven, uh, baked for about eight minutes, and it's got kind of brown around the top edges, so. It should be done enough. I think 
condensed mixed oil. We're going to fold in our whipped topping. Gently fold that in. That our crust is cooled down and we have our filling ready, we're going to spoon that into the shell, pie shell crust. Now we're going to pop that in the freezer for a couple of hours and let it get set. And there you have your hazelnut cocoa pie. And uh, the longer you leave it in the freezer, the firmer it'll get. And I hope you enjoy this as much as I do. If you do, please like, share, and subscribe. Thanks.